So I created a dashboard specially for you, the harsh reality of manual testers. Why 70% of the people are going to be replaced in the industry now. Even if you are an automation tester, why still your career is in jeopardize? Guys, manual testing jobs are changing very fast in 2025 and it feels very scary. You know why? Because I think in the end of the video, I'm going to tell you right exactly what are the roles which are at a risk, what are the skills which are in demand and I'm going to give you a 100 day plan also that you need to focus right now even as a manual tester or even if you are an automation tester to learn and add automation and AI directly into your skills to save yourself. Okay, guys, I lead a team of more than 20 plus people of in India and mentor a lot of people already, you know this, right? So we are going to discuss about something which is called as harsh reality of manual testing, right? What is happening right now in this case? And I want to show you something important data also cyber side, which is 73% of the companies are actively shifting towards the automation and hybrid role. So first point I want to discuss is that most of the companies are not hiring only for manual roles nowadays. They are shifting for hybrid roles. What is a hybrid role? Either it will be manual plus automation or it will be automation manual plus AI or it will be DevOps related plus manual plus AI or it will be related to multiple ones which I'm going to discuss with you. 27% of QNG currently are un unemployed which is a data which is uh, again a references I will share with you in the chat. This is again the data which is basically given by the perplexity. I have basically searched around multiple sources on this and 5 out of 1 markets are in favor of automation jobs. What do you mean by this? For example, this is what I want to show you especially which is if you go with the expansion data overall in the top ending company right there are manual testing jobs are almost 237 where you will see automation profiles are almost 1190 overall in this case so it means automation people even HRs are preferring in this case right here you can read more about it here also that TCS offers 200 more automation as compared to the manual road so what is happening and how to save yourself I'm going to discuss about like how what is the 100 day plan that we need to discuss how 30 days of plan of if you can give one hour per day you can learn java or a programming language to save yourself it is easy trust me you don't have to fear about coding how exactly you need to learn about selenium in a 30 hour or approach if you start giving one hour per day and even the postman and the rest assured and also, if you have extra time, how you can add in next 21 days your uh, learn generative AI, AI agents also, which are very much popular to create this hybrid profile. All right. So let's get started with this. Sure. One thing I want to tell you that automation overall market explosion is happening where you can see with the data also that nowadays automation jobs plus AI jobs are getting more and more popular. Right. Recently, also, I have created this video also almost one lakh of employees in India, especially, right, we have seen that eliminated in 2025. And do you know what is the point? The most of the roles are manual testers. 45% of global tech employees are expected for the job reduction, but because of an AI. But I personally think that yes, AI will definitely come but it will not going to replace overall the manual stuff that we generally do. But we have to switch to the instead of manual, we have to shift towards the manual plus automation plus AI role or manual plus DevOps role or any programming language in this case. This is my personal view that which I think should be there. So step number one, the harsh reality. Companies are shifting to hybrid roles. It will be a manual plus AI plus automation that I have already discussed with you. This is the first thing which is happening nowadays. This is the first point which I want to discuss that we need to take on. Full manual testers are shrinking. I have recently launched a QA job board. I don't know if you guys know this. QA jobs board I have recently launched. I have talked to almost 70 plus HRs in last three months and most of them are saying we don't want to hire any kind of of the manual testers we need hybrid role either they in automation or we are not hiring so rule number one which we have to understand is companies are shifting for this and we need to understand that yes we need the more important thing which is the hybrid role overall in this case okay important point that definitely see the most important point which i want to highlight it again guys this is not a video about scaring you and everything this is a tactical video to understand what exactly are the next step for us even as a manual tester even as an automation tester even as a QA what is the next step for us AI does not replace the human judgment it replaces the repetition and execution so reposition out yourself so hybrid real is the solution which I personally think that should happening in this case I remember uh, one of my mentee I five years back was stuck and now after learning AI plus automation also now he is basically implemented was able to switch also multiple scenarios we have seen it like this is the way that we need to do second 
very important point which I want to discuss, which is this, which is roles and skills are important to win in year 2025. What do you mean by this? It means that everyone previously, all of you were basically like this, that okay, we will not be learning any kind of programming language. I am afraid of programming language. I am afraid of learning Selenium. I am afraid of learning Playwright. I am afraid of learning Postman or even the rest assured also. But nowadays, it's no, no in this case. If you want to become an SDET or something, yes, the important thing is you have to learn UI, API and CI, which is CI, CD also. So the overall stack is now increased. If you see my 100 day plan, 30 days to 45 days, if you start giving one hour per day, you can complete your core Java profile. Here, Postman and Assist Short, 30 hours is more than enough if you start giving with practice, with framework knowledge. And here in the Selenium also, 30 to 45 days you can give and 10 days for your CI CD profiles. Plus, furthermore, if you need details, I have oh, topic wise also, I have divided these are the details and these are the uh, overall roadmaps that you will find. By the way, this is the extra one, which is uh, with AI also, how you need to learn AI, the top important points that I will discuss later part in, the, in this case. Okay. So this is very, very important, right? So overall, if you want to save yourself, the point number two, which I want to highlight is test automation role, quality role, where shift left testing pipeline and matrices you need to learn. AI argumented uh, testers or niche specialist, especially related to accessibility performance is a thing. Add a knowledge of automation plus AI into your profile. That is the most simplest thing that I can show you in this case. Now, I'm going to show you the 100 day plan of survival so now last part in this case 30 day plan generally and i call this as a 100 day plan if you start giving one hour per day i think for next three to four months your plan should be that i will be following a proper roadmap to learn about java api and selenium why i recommend java because most of the companies are still hiring for java and there are a lot of opening related to it out of 10 7 jobs are always related to java which i have seen and personally on linkedin also you can see the data overall also now 30 day plan 30 days of java 30 of this that you need to follow step by step and you need to overall if I show you also, mark your overall progress and create something called as your overall portfolio like this. So this is, again, I have basically shown you in the overall batches also, which I generally say, for example, 11x. Here you can see we have a Selenium automation framework. We have API automation framework and overall Java programs like this. So here, if I show you, this is Selenium automation framework that we created, which is running on Docker container thread local. Here it we have the automation framework uh, in rest assured, which basically from the end with the alert report and the overall Java programs that we have with the nodes overall that you need to do around like 400 plus programs that you need to do to get a skill into this. So survival plan is very simple. You need to follow for next three to four months, become very serious, right? To learn about automation. And that is the harsh reality, which I want you to discuss in this case. I hope this makes sense. Overall, if you take hundred companies, this is the data that I have shown you, right? Manual testing jobs, again, declining. We have a one to five ratios, which is there. Skill ev evaluation is something that we need to do. ROI of a company is automation always give you more ROI, which way we have seen. If you are a manual tester, hybrid skill requirement, specialization in the area, add AI and automation directly into this. Long-term opportunities and goal for you will be to learn learn and get into the automation with AI, especially in this case. Now, a couple of people will ask me, sir, how do we learn AI in this case? Guys, I am preparing a overall roadmap, 30 days if you give one hour per day, how to can learn AI fundamental and prompt engineering, generative AI, AI for test automation, advanced AI tools, which are creating your MCP servers and connecting and, and learning any time also. So overall roadmap is almost ready. I will share with you all the resources if you need, right? I need the roadmaps. I need all the details. Just comment down. Just give me resource in the chat and we have a hundred like and hundred comments target and also if you want to hear about this overall in the two hours of live session which i am basically organizing where we will be discussing about how you can to become a job ready automation tester with three secret techniques i am organizing like live you can attend it uh, link will be also in the pinned comment thanks for watching i hope this helps again this video is not about the demotivation it's about learning focus and make sure that you get results thank you for watching stay awesome and keep learning. Okay.